You ready, guys? Oh, yeah. Hey, guys, it's Dr. Emmer. We're near the end of the day and have a beautiful patient, an exciting, exciting story. One of my first patients that actually wants to hold a halo light <laughs> while we do the um, injections. And I'm super excited because this is her first time with mm -hmm. me. I have an amazing canvas, and you guys know I do a lot of facial sculpting. What I, what I say is, what is that? Everyone asks me, you know, mm -hmm. fillers, they think of it as filling lines and plumping the face. That's not what we try and do with fillers. We mm -hmm. want to lift, we want to shape, we want to reverse the aging process by creating a contour and by creating a foundation. So we already have mm -hmm. an amazing foundation, nice jawline, projected chin, elevated cheekbone, but there's certain things we can do to do enhancement. We can lift the cheek up, mm -hmm. we can fill out the temple and lift the brow, soften some of the lines, build out the area under the mouth around the chin to help sort of sagging jowl and such like that. So that's what we're gonna do. And we're gonna use two products to do that. They're best friends with each other. One's called Radius. If you take a look, I'm gonna show you that here. It's a white opaque product made of calcium, which builds collagen over time. This is our lifter, this is our sculptor, this is our volumizer. Then our second product is Bellatero which is a soft, smooth gel. If you take a look at that one, it looks like a swimming pool, clear water, beautiful clear water, because this is a really soft gel that's used as the finishing touch. It's used on top to fill out fine lines, to soften folds, etc. So we're gonna start up at the top. We're gonna do a little injection to the temple. Turn your head a little bit to the right. And this area is extremely mm -hmm. vascular, so you have to be really careful. You really know what you're doing. Count of three, one, two, three. We're gonna do a little injection, go all the way down, and we just do a subtle depot down into the temple. And this will allow us to give some support to the lateral cheek, but also, hold on. Got that little clog, hold right there a second. You need a different, also allows us to lift the brow. So, sorry if that was mm -hmm. a second injection point, but one, two, three, we're gonna go all the way down, good. And we're just gonna give a little bit. Now what's weird is you sometimes can hear it. Mm -hmm. It sounds a little crackly, mm -hmm. but it's safe, okay? So we're gonna do a little depot right there. Now we'll go help again, enhance, and then what we're gonna do is just build upon her awesome cheekbone, directly on the zygomatic arch, right down to the bone, depot injection, a little depot injection. And then again, we're gonna go right down to the bone, nice and slow. Depot injection, small amount. And again, a little bit higher on the bone, depot injection. She has the ability to really pull off a nice elevation. You can see already, just look at that small amount, how much it just shadows and just builds that contour. So if you look at her face straight, it's much more lifted. Okay, Michaela, hold right there. Yes. We're gonna switch now to the opposite side and do that same thing. We're gonna even it all out. I'm gonna come around the front. And I'm gonna kind of just do it. Is anyone asking anything? They're usually either making comments. Is it painful? No, nothing. No pain. We'll turn a little bit this way. She's doing great. Now all we're gonna do again, if you go real slow. And you do a little bit of that, you know, vibratory technique. And I know a lot of people nowadays are using these devices that do the vibration for you. But they were just copying me because I did that with my finger <laughs> for a long time. Okay. That's, That's okay. Because I, I hit you. That's great. It's fine. And again, we're going to follow a nice line going from the corner of her mouth to the top of her ear to really build upon her lateral cheekbone because she has an amazing canvas already. We're just gonna build, build, build so that we get some lateral lifting and get some gorgeous contour. She really can pull this off, this look. You know, it's really kind of mm -hmm. sculpted and defined look, which I love. If you can see that already, take a look. Just that nice sort of elevation. She's gonna see that when she puts the makeup on, etc. So now we're gonna go back to the opposite side. We're gonna switch. Mm -hmm. So we're going to work our way around. We're still building that mid-face. Why do we want to build the mid-face? So as people age, this area starts to descend. Mm -hmm. And so by lifting it, it helps lift the folds and help the under eye area, mm -hmm. which is fantastic. We just do a subtle bit. 
again, to really just get that nice lift and shaping. And again, going slow is important because it limits the amount of bruising, the amount of swelling. Right now we're just giving support to what I call the C area, temple, lateral cheek, under eye. Go all the way around that area and we wanna lift that area to really give her a nice contour. Oh, I can't wait to see this. Mm -hmm. Now, one of my tricks, turn here, mm -hmm. and the women that can do this, mm -hmm. is we go, we follow that line, and we just do some little threads mm -hmm. right along the area you would use makeup mm -hmm. to define that shadow, you know, okay. that zygomatic mm -hmm. arch. That what do you contouring. call that in makeup? Contouring. 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 So we're now, we're using fillers do that same thing. I'm just doing little baby depots, little threads right along that contour. And that's gonna allow us to really give some definition. We'll show this in a sec. Okay. Okay, we're gonna give her some nice elevation. Oh, that's perfect. So hold right here for a second, then we'll show the other side. I'm gonna go to the other side and do that. <coughs> She's gonna look amazing. So exciting. <laughs> I'm excited. love it in a couple of days from now because mm -hmm. when all the swelling goes down mm -hmm. it really fits it really looks amazing so again we're gonna move our way forward and inject a little bit to lift the mid phase are you doing in pain nothing very minimal great you're awesome you are just a strong woman <laughs> perfect oh, that's good so again now following that line we're not going to over volumize the center, the medial part, which is right here in her face, because that's her, that's her shape, you know, mm -hmm. it's, she has that model-esque look. We don't want to over, uh, overdo trying to change that or change her look. So we don't want to do that. We just want to continue that contouring. We're going to go one breath higher, a little elevation. And then the last little trick is now the last part is give a little support to the nose and the end of the nasolabial fold that blends the cheek and lifts up the upper lip. Hold right here. Coming back around. And the last part, perfect, so it's me. Okay, turn a little bit, good. We're gonna soften, soften, soften. Right there. So let's at least show you what that mm -hmm. looks like where we were really able to define out cheek now obviously you have to ignore swelling mm -hmm. but look at the lateral contour mm -hmm. i see it you guys see this lateral mm -hmm. contour elevation here lifting here so mid face mm -hmm. lateral cheek temple now we're going to lift the brow okay <laughs> now we're going to lift the brow which is my fave there's a couple ways to do it you can go right into the brow on the lateral edge which we're going to do right here so i can show you guys nice and slow just give a little depot product on the lateral edge. Another one, nice and superficial, little depot product right there to get a nice little plump. One of the other techniques we like to do is right here on the bone, a very safe location. If you go all the way down, right to the bone, little pinch, you okay? Mm -hmm. Good. Give a little depot of that product right there. It just pops up that edge of the brow. Look at that. Right there, it just pops it up. The last part I like to do is go right to the edge of the eye, the corner of the eye, and give a little pop right in there so it blends the cheek, but it also fills the corner of the eye out a little bit because a lot of people actually get hollowing in there and mm -hmm. they don't even notice. And then to touch up, we go right to the middle part of the eye, just a slight bit. Give it just a little bit to help the dark circle and a little bit to the eye, medial eye hollow, which will massage, massage, massage just lightly to get a little bit in there and you get a nice contour again. Okay, so now I'm gonna have you hold right here. Kayla, good. Let's go to the other side. Sweet to you. Thank you, come on around. That was cool. <laughs> That's amazing. Okay, mm -hmm. tips and tricks. Mm -hmm. So now we're gonna do that same thing. We're just gonna lift this slightly very superficially go in there, go right into the lateral brow, very little, little baby depot, right into lifting, 
the edge of this brow. And then again, I go right here to that safe place on the bone, which feels a little weird, right into the brow. Just a small amount, and that pops it up. Right there. And then again, to the lateral part of the eye, just to give a little pop to the edge of the cheek that we just filled. And a small, subtle bit to the medial part of the eye. Massage it in, just very lightly. And now we've rounded it out. A more of the eye crease. Beautiful. So now we've really done a really nice mid face, up face elevation. Yeah. And we can fine tune lastly. Mm -hmm. That's a good starting point. Yes, great. Okay. Look at this brow elevation. That is awesome. Look at that. Wow. It's amazing. Mm -hmm. So, and you said, oh my god, you look so hot. Okay. <laughs> so, can't get over it. It's so good. It looks so good. Okay, now, the mm -hmm. last trick, okay? We're going to soften the lines just subtly. Smile as big as you can. You like to have a little smile. Okay, relax, little smile line. But I like to kind of plump this area just as soft, softening. It's almost like chapstick. Mm -hmm for the fold, as I tell people. The other key element is turn a little bit here. If you have a very straight chin, you mm -hmm. want to round it out just a little bit because it'll balance the new higher cheekbones. So we're going to do little depot injections, baby depot injections along. Some people call this the marionette area. Mm -hmm. Some people call this the jawline. Whatever you want to call it, we're just fine tuning it. Mm -hmm. Just subtle, nothing crazy, just small baby depot injections right there. Same thing to the middle part of the chin, just a little deeper injection to kind of round it out. Okay, we'll go to the other side. Do that same thing. It's just a refresher, you know mm -hmm. what I mean? Are they saying anything on there? On social, you guys? I haven't heard anything. Mm -hmm. Someone Who's, wants to know what products you're using. Well, yeah, we, let them know. We're using Bellatero. Uh, for softening right now, and are they saying hi from any countries? Mm -hmm. A lot of times they tell me. Is radius better than hyaluronic acid to build well, cheekbone? Well, that's the, the thing. Tomorrow. We're using both, you guys. Mm -hmm. that's and that was my trick. We're combining the two to get a lift and a softening effect. So it's not that one's better than the other. It's how the artist uses the paintbrush. So we're 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 doing it in multiple ways. Let's see. Let's smile. Okay, good. Right. Great. So we're using both to help build not only a softening effect, but also a volumization effect. Mm. Okay, and then we're also, if you see, we're just kind of just lightly building her a little bit on her jawline. Trying to come around. How long does it last? Well, it depends. This one will last about six to nine months. The, the calcium-based product, the Radius, will last about a year to a year and a half. So she's going to really mm -hmm. get an awesome change. So now, using those four syringes, we were able to lift the cheekbone and elevate the brow, help subtly the under eye, soften the folds, and build out a little on the chin. So sit up just a little bit so you can look at yourself straight on. Mm -hmm. Now, oh, yeah. tell me what you think. Turn a little this way. That's mm -hmm. what I want you oh, to yeah. see. Do you see that? I want that forever. And look at this. <laughs> yeah. Isn't that awesome? I don't want it to go away. <laughs> I know. Now look at the brow. That's crazy. It's awesome. I really needed that. So the no Botox brow lift, mm -hmm. which looks fantastic. Yeah. And then from there, you guys, it's good to build. I always mm -hmm. start slow, work your way. Your body isn't used to having right. a lot of fillers all the time. It holds water, it mm -hmm. builds structure. Mm -hmm. You leave it, and then we always fine tune. The key here is not to have a one and done. It's to mm -hmm. understand how you're injecting fillers and go to somebody that can look at your face and build over time. So mm -hmm. now we started the process of building out the jaw, lifting the, the cheek temple area and softening the folds and also the chin crease now look at this you have like yeah this, this you have the model-esque heart-shaped perfect heart-shaped <laughs> face fierce yeah fierce yes. fine bold Somebody gorgeous commented that she is snatched <laughs> Wait, that's usually that a hip 
That's usually um, when the waist is when, super yeah. tight and the buttock is really defined. Oh, I'm snatched. That's yeah. what they said. So snatch, <laughs> snatch could also be super tight on the face and super contoured, which is which is good to show. If you look this way, look. The key here is to not yeah, touch that. this area. Mm -hmm. If you fill this area, she'll mm -hmm. lose the structure of her face. Mm -hmm. You don't want to round it out. We're defining right. what she has. No, I love that. I love it. What do you think? I'm obsessed. Me too. <laughs> Have a good day, Thank everybody. Thank you. Bye. Bye.